weekend like this in the longest time. Back at the start of the year, I feel like I did quite a few different solo things. Like I freaking went to Italy by myself and had a kind of a few different solo weekends, but just lately, life has just been so, so busy. I'm just doing a little bit of makeup because I wanna feel good for our solo weekends. Every time I say I'm only gonna do a little bit of makeup and I literally end up doing nearly my whole routine. <laughs> later I have got all my stuff for the gift boxes I think it actually went really really well so I'm gonna go and now and head to a bookshop I don't really know what I'm gonna do there because I don't really plan on buying books because I read everything on my Kindle but I suppose we're going for the vibe you know and you don't even have to tell me I did this in the wrong order I know I did because now I'm stuck lugging everything around My favourite books are definitely, I love like the romantic, like fun books, you know. I feel like I couldn't imagine myself getting into something too deep. But you know what I love as well as about books is the cover. If it's a nice cover, like that makes me feel like I could read it more than one that's just like, it just doesn't look like me. I had a gorgeous cafe in there, but it was so hot. There was no air con or anything. I definitely couldn't have sat and had that. So I'm going to go to another cafe. Hopefully they have air con, get a little cold drink and do some editing outside of home. So I feel like switching up your environment is important. How easy it would be to fall for you But that of course is something I won't do Cause we've agreed between you and me We're nothing Silly it would be to put this. I'm not gonna show you exactly what I picked up today because you'll see that all later. But I just wanted to show you a sneak peek because I'm so I'm so happy and I'm so excited. So this is just a super super small sneak peek of what is to come. Eek, I'm so happy I picked up stuff and the rest of the stuff is on is on order. So that is fabulous but i picked up these for myself from primark these are the wrist wash bands you need to put them on your wrist to stop the water going down i feel such a great idea these are so soft these are a pound 50 from primark it is literally half past six and i just had my lunch <laughs> when luke goes away like i don't know i just like my time management's bad but honestly, if I live by myself, I don't know what the frick I'd do. Anyway, I want to bake. I want to make some banana muffins. My manager actually, well, I said I said to her on Friday, because we normally had like a ketchup. And I said, I want to bake. Got some bananas that need yeast and earth. So I'm making banana muffins. And she says they are so, so good. And I also want to go and watch the sunset. So I need to leave in about half an hour. Tell me why I do this to myself. Am I feeling all right? I don't know. I lack emotional intelligence, so I'm not sure. I could be on the brink of a breakdown and I couldn't even tell you. has just set so I'm gonna go down now and watch it in my life I have never ever gone down to specifically watch like a sunset or a sunrise which is why I thought we'll do it today you can see it like reflecting there it's so pretty at the moment but apparently the best light is kind of like 40 minutes after it's set so I'm gonna go down bring my journal and just sit and watch the sun Seen so many times before, but I 
Like genuinely, the gratitude that I felt, like where I live, like just the sunset. So I picked up dinner and also picked up an Amazon parcel. It's water filters. The little like cartridges that you need to replace. And this is how the muffins are looking. They're looking so, so good. I got a Pepsi Mart. I got some bagels, which were reduced to 20 pence because they expire today. And I got some cheese, the cards. And I have got smart period in the cupboard because I'm gonna make bagel pizzas. Now I've wanted to make these for ages. I think I have made them before, but I don't know. I just, I really wanted to make them again. Crack open this. Oh my gosh, that is not the best like noise in the world. Mm -mm -mm. 10 10. These are the bagels. I do think I overdid them a little bit. I'm sure they will taste good, but I'm gonna put some Disney on. I might be so late to this, but I didn't realize The Little Mermaid was on Netflix. I mean, Disney. I might watch that. The Little Mermaid, because I haven't seen it. No, oh, right. Just burned. Oh, and I put too much pepper on as well. Oh, my tongue. Good morning, guys. It is 10 past 6. I've been up for like half an hour basically and i don't know why i'm running late considering it's so early in the morning but we're off to watch the sunrise so i think i'm already cutting it a bit close because it right it like officially rises in 20 minutes and it's already kind of pink so i'm hoping that i haven't missed it this is what it currently looks like let's go see you sunset Sunrise, why do I keep getting them wrong? Do it by me just sitting up, setting up a picnic blanket if I can quarter past six in the morning. But this is kind of the best view that I can get of it. And I am in a very, it's like an awkward place. Like I'm in the middle of like a main road and like the tram stop. Got my little banana muffin. Oh my gosh, sorry. Piccadilly, yeah. yeah. Where do I get it most? How do I order for a, a cab here? That is not how I expected my Sunday morning to go. I didn't feel I, I didn't feel like unsafe or anything, so that's why I was like talking. I even brought my panic alarm with me. Let me show you here. Basically, trying to get to Shoot Hill because he had a bus in Newcastle at seven o'clock. Basically, ended up ordering him an Uber, so that was fine. He he's like, "What's your name?" And I was like, "Jess." He was like, "Jeff." Okay, Jeff. And then he wanted my number and then he like checked my number work so i couldn't like lie but oh, i don't know it was it was weird but i think he was i think he was nice because then he rang me just, that's he just rang me to say thank you back to watching the sunset and now i'm gonna journal i guess um so it's now seven o'clock but he must have thought what is she doing here and then he was like where do you live and i was like um i'm not telling you that anyway back to the sunset oh my gosh i meant sunrise The security guy came over and said oh, where I was sitting was private property. So now I'm back where I was last night where I was watching the sun set. Future sunrise is going forward. We need to wake up something different. I made a little list of stuff. It's just like just some necessity stuff because I am going to Brighton on Wednesday for the rest of the week. Well, until the weekend, but we normally just kind of just buy random food bits on the weekend. We don't need that much stuff to be honest. And I am gonna try meal prep tonight. I'm gonna do sausage and mash because I haven't had that in ages and I just want something different, you know. I feel like I ate so much chicken that I genuinely was sick of sick of the sight of chicken. So I just wanted some red meat back in our lives. I've also seen on TikTok, right, that MS are like having a major like clearance or something because they're getting ready for all their Christmas food which is so good to hear from me I mean we probably don't need anything but I'm gonna go have a look anyway because there's an m &S literally right next to Aldi if you didn't know we're a wheelie bag family it's just so good absolutely no shame it saves us so much hassle <laughs>
final solo meal time. So I'm gonna make my dinner. So I've taken out a burger and a bun because I thought, okay, I'll have a burger. Then I'm also gonna make the meal prep of the mash and potatoes because I know, I know myself, I'll be hating myself if I didn't do it. And then tomorrow night, when I've had a super busy day at work, I will then have to cook sausages and mash. So I'm just gonna do it all now and make my future self happy. If you're saying Coke Zero is better than Pepsi Max, I disagree. I disagree. Gorgeous vibes for some gorgeous people. I love a burger. I haven't had a burger in so long. I had such a good weekend, love doing stuff, love doing new stuff, like sunset stuff. Although it's so small, like it means so much to me because I've always wanted to do that and I've never done it, but now I have. With you guys as well. I'm gonna love you and leave you and I'm, I'm, thank you so much for spending a gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous solo weekend with me. Make sure you stay tuned for next time, subscribe. If you're new and you made it this far, I'm here every Wednesday. Love you guys, bye.